Hey everybody, Lisa Roberry here. Welcome back to my channel. Happy Friday. Holy moly, I'm really glad this week is over. This was a little bit of a stressful week and I didn't turn off my phone ringer. <laughs> So I'm really glad this week is over, uh, but more importantly, I'm really excited to share with you what I was warming because I went through some stuff. So obviously this isn't all in one week. Um, I did not upload my video for what I was warming last week, so we're just going to get it all done in this video. I didn't burn anything last week. Oh, there's another one. I didn't burn anything last week, but um, something that I was done melting last week was this sugared lemon zest from Bath and Body Works. This was in the candle crock. I'm really glad this is done because I'm pretty much over it at this point. This one was a crazy soot machine when I was burning it, so that's why I moved it over to the candle crock. Um, but yeah, I'm just, I'm over it, so I'm, I'm glad that's done. Next for what else I was burning this week, actually technically starting last night. <laughs> like I said, I had like, it, it was just, it was just one of those weeks. It was just one of those weeks. So I decided um, to break out my lavender coconut from White Barn. And it is this really pretty purple glass. I really, really love this. It's really nice. Um, I think it's just, it is totally relaxing. You do get a perfect combination of just lavender and a slight hint of coconut. It's more lavender than coconut, I think, um, but I think it's a really, really nice balance. So um, I did go ahead and light that from White Burn. Now, <laughs> let's talk Scentsy. Like I said, we went through quite a bit. Um, okay. Where do I even start? Let's start with last week, shall we? So I was really excited to start. Let me kind of put these in an order here. That makes sense to me. Okay. We're good. So I was really excited to jump in to these brand new scents um, that were just recently released this month. So I started out, the very first scent I jumped into was kiwi fruit. Um, and this, it's, oh gosh, I love the way this smells. I really, really do. It is a perfect, clean, fruity, kiwi scent. It's really, really light, really, really light. And the performance or the lack thereof completely sucked. So not to make this a negative video in any way, but um, <laughs> so far the brand new scents are not super great. There is one that has blown my mind and we'll get to that, but, and I haven't gotten to all of the new scents, really just three, just three. So I'm not, I'm not bashing all the brand new scents, like I said, there's one that rocked my world and there's, oh no, four. I, I, I did, I did get to four of the brand new scents. So four of the brand new scents, one of them rocked my world. So kiwi fruit was a dud, but honest and truly, if you are someone who likes your scents lighter, you may really like this because me personally, I like scents to like, you walk into a room and it knocks you in your face. I personally like that. Not everyone is like that. In fact, I have some people who just want to use one cube in their warmer rather than two, just to make it a, a slightly lighter scent. So honestly, you may like this if you like scents um, that are a little bit lighter and not super strong. Um, and if you like fruity light scents, you, re you may really like kiwi fruit. I love the way this smells. I just wish it was amped up about 10 times. <laughs> So as you can see, I went through a whole bar. I literally, I put two cubes in, cause this was at the office. I put two cubes in the warmer in the lobby and then two cubes in the warmer in the break room. So they're at two completely opposite ends of the, of the office. And honestly, I got like two days out of it. But I mean, where I, I'm, I'm being honest. I got two days out of it. So then I went ahead and put in I'm sorry guys, my husband's calling me. Hold on. <laughs> and we're back. <laughs> okay, so getting back to it. So kiwi fruit. I really, really like this. If you are someone who really likes light scents, I think you'll enjoy this. I personally got 
about two days out of two cubes. That's really not good for Scentsy. If there is anyone else out there that got the kiwi fruit let me know how your performance is i'm wondering if there's a bad batch or what because scentsy you always get a solid like three four five days sometimes i always my wax always lasts me one week that's why i like to do my weekly fragrance videos because it basically lasts me a week so this just didn't so i went through an entire bar in one week because after two days i swapped out the scent and the first day was really great, but then it died down quite a bit by the second day. By the third day, I personally couldn't really smell it unless I was on top of the warmer. So if you have a really small area, this might be nice too. I'm starting to talk for a really long time on one scent, so we're going to move on. <laughs> so kiwi fruit. Eh, I don't know if I'm going to purchase it again. I really love the scent. I just wish it was stronger. Next. Oh, geez. Okay. Summer Soleil. <laughs> So I butchered the name of this and I was mortified, but there was someone who did correct me and I really appreciate it because I'm a ding dong and I didn't realize that that's how you pronounce it. Honestly, I had a feeling that I was pronouncing it wrong. So when, when I got called out on it, I really appreciate it and it totally was not a surprise. So there you have it. Okay. Summer Soleil. I went through an entire bar of this. So this was actually at the house here. And I love this. It's a really nice tropical fragrance, but once again, it was pretty light. Um, and please let me know if you have any of these bars, if you have warmed them and if you have thought your performance was, was great or fine or whatever, let me know. I don't know. I, I have, I'm having some allergies and I'm like, I'm hoping that's what maybe it is. I'm praying that's what it is, <laughs> but this was kind of a dud for me too. I kind of got like two days, two, three days out of it. I think I got three days out of this. It was really nice, but once again, really, really light. And I had this going at the house, so I have my dogs here. And I don't know if it was just needing to work too hard. I, I don't. I don't know, but I wanted to smell it. I, I just, I was like wanting, <laughs> I was wanting it to be stronger. So yeah, I don't know. Summer Soleil, really nice. If you like lighter tropical fruity scents, you will love this. You will absolutely love it. It's just, once again, I wish it was stronger. Okay. <clears throat> Last dud. <laughs> and then we'll get to positive. <laughs> I promise. This utterly breaks my heart and I'm going to give it another chance. I think, actually, I think I even, you'll see those boxes back there. That's my next haul. Yay. So I'll be, that'll be the next video to go up. And I think I have more of this bar in those boxes. Southern sweet tea. <laughs> I am so sad. This was another disappointment. It was really light. Once again, these scents are phenomenal. Like you smell them. This smells like peach tea. Scentsy hit the nail on the head. They totally did an amazing job with the fragrance, but I don't know what they did as far as the performance goes. I don't know what the mix was. The performance just wasn't super great. So you can see I still have, oh, who's joining us? Deuce. Hi, buddy. He's been like super sticky to me <laughs> since last night. He, um, like I said, I've had like a really stressed out week. Yesterday was pretty bad. Um, and the dogs have just been totally stuck to me like glue. And that's not normally like Deuce anyway. Zoe usually hangs out, but Deuce doesn't usually. So, <laughs> and he's leaving. He's just checking on me. Um, okay. So Southern Sweet Tea, I was super disappointed. Um, I, I'm going to give this another shot. I only had it in two warmers. I had it in the warmer that's next to where I sit in the living room. And then I had it in the warmer that is in my kitchen. So we have kind of, it's an open concept. So I was hoping I'd be able, who's, who is this? It's still Deuce. Hi bud. Um, so I still have a few cubes and I'm going to give this another shot. Plus I think I have a few more bars that are in those boxes back there. So I'm definitely gonna give it another try. I'm just really hoping that this isn't a complete dud. 
I just, I, I think I got like three days out of this, but it's really light. Okay. Southern sweet tea. Bummer, dude. Okay. Now for what has rocked my world <laughs> for the new releases is pistachio ice cream. Whew, this was such a relief, such a good surprise. It's amazing. And I think I need to have about a hundred bars of this. <laughs> it's so, so good. I love this. It's going right now. In fact, I had one of my friends send me a message. I believe it was on Instagram and she sent me a message and actually asking me about this scent asking because she, she thought that it was pretty light now i don't know do i have a hair on my lip dog hair um she thought it was pretty light so she wanted to know what my thoughts were on it now i don't know if because of my experience with the other three I honestly, this is a really good performer. It, it is, I think this has the Scentsy standard. It's totally what you would expect and what you would hope out of a Scentsy bar. Um, I, to start out when, cause when she first messaged me, I hadn't broken this out yet. So since she told me it was light, I thought, okay, I, I had all my warmers off. I put two cubes in this room here, which is upstairs on the like front end of the house. And then I put two cubes in the master bedroom, which is on the complete opposite side of the house, still upstairs, but on the opposite side. I only had those two warmers going, which is not like me. I normally have a ton of warmers going because like I said, I like my sense to be incredibly strong in your face. I want to smell it in every aspect of the house. So I only had it in two warmers. Honestly, I could smell it throughout the entire upstairs. Not only that, but it was um, on a, I want to say it was Thursday last week. So I needed to bring the trash cans down because our trash day here is on Fridays. So I took the trash cans down in the morning and I, or Thursday night, Friday morning, whatever day it was, I took the trash cans out and it's been nice here. And I had the windows open. I could smell this downstairs to the street so i mean not like wow it's strong but i caught like a whiff of it and i was just like this is amazing this is a great performer so i would say and then i proceeded since it was so amazing i went ahead and slapped it in the rest of my warmers upstairs and this has been performing amazing so i i want to say you're gonna get a solid week out of use out of this. So out of two cubes and one warmer, you should be able to get it a, a solid week, just like what you would with every other Scentsy bar. So, or most, most other Scentsy scents. Um, uh, pistachio ice cream has rocked my world. I love, love, love it. I will be purchasing, purchasing many more of that scent. Next, I have a few things to talk about that are no longer around anymore. Um, bring back my bar Flutter from January. I put this in the warmer in the hall. This one's a pretty light one as well. Um, I just put it in the hall outside of our bedroom because my husband doesn't like the way this smells. <laughs> it's honestly, it's pretty light, but it smells like an orange creamsicle to me. That smells really good though. So there was that. And then because, because those bars were just so bad performing, um, I broke out some of the ones that I knew would be good. So this is definitely taking it back. So we had a limited edition set of Indigo. So it was six different fragrances all in different shades of blue um, or indigo. Uh, and so I broke that out because I still have, I think three, now I think I have two bars left of the indigo collection. So I thought, you know, let me just break this out. So oh, this is really nice. Indigo spirit, it's like a, um, it's like a berries. Like it, it's a vanilla with berries. It's really, really nice. It's actually going downstairs right now. Um, also what is going downstairs right now, <laughs> I broke out my stash of blackberry meringue from last year. I'm so sad since didn't bring this back. I love blackberry meringue. Oh, it's amazing. It is fresh and fruity and pastry and fantastic. And I just love it. 
I have several bars of this and I'm really glad I have some because I don't feel bad about using it. So I have that going downstairs as well. Something that is still around that you can purchase. I actually meant to bring my soap in here. So Bath and Body Works has a soap right now. I believe it's coconut vanilla or vanilla coconut. It's fantastic. It smells amazing. It's literally just pure fresh coconut and almost like a perfumey vanilla. I want to duplicate that. <laughs> so I had one cube left of coconut vanilla orchid and I had one cube left of simply vanilla. So I decided to mix these two and I know that for the coconut vanilla orchid it says that there's vanilla in there and there is. You get this like you do get this slight very slight vanilla note but it's more of a perfumey perfumey coconut so i decided to mix it with simply vanilla which is our like perfumey vanilla scent i love this by itself but it's really nice to mix with other things so i actually mixed these two i'm in love with this combination i don't know that i got a dupe i don't think i'll ever be able to get a dupe for the soap but this is fantastic. I am in love with this and I think I need a six pack with just three bars of the coconut vanilla orchid and three bars of the simply vanilla. It is so good. It is so good. It's perfect for spring and honestly it's just very it's a very simple fragrance. It's so good. So is that it? That's it. That's what I warmed for the last two weeks. <laughs> warmed and burned. So um, thank you so much for watching this crazy long video, slightly negative, but I want to be honest. You guys know I'm going to be honest with you. So these guys that don't perform real great uh, doesn't mean it's not going to be a great scent for you. I just know that there's a lot of people who like their fragrance really strong the way I do. So if you are that person, I don't know, maybe just use these in really small rooms, <laughs> not like an open concept because I think these would be fine in a smaller area, but these just didn't perform real great. So I'm going to be honest with you, but I'll, I'll give them another try. I, I would say giving them one more try and I'll definitely report back. So, all right, that is it for my home fragrance for this week. Like I said, you do see those beautiful boxes back there. We will be opening those next. Um, I'm hoping I should be able to get that up this weekend, if not by the latest Monday for sure. So thank you so much for watching. I hope everybody had a really great week. Please let me know if you have any questions. Uh, as always, I will leave my contact information down below. Thank you so much. I will talk to you soon.